Here we go guys, I'm going to ruin another exercise for you, but not really, I'm just trying to educate you and show you how important the psoas is and getting pressure off it when it comes to your workouts because that could cause a lot of back pain which would keep you from uh, you know, your workouts or even just getting UPRs, right? No one wants to work out when they're hurting. Okay, so the thing with the tight psoas here, go ahead and hold this for a minute, is I know look, I sacrificed the hair tie for y'all, but look, if it's hanging here, right, and it is so tight that it has to stretch all the way out, there's gonna be some kind of recoil. That tension has to come from somewhere, and that's gonna end up pulling all these vertebrae forward and doing what's called anterior tilt. So Manny's gonna show us what that looks like here for the anterior tilt. As you can see, almost like a little mini twerk, right? But you stay stuck that way, and now you're walking with your butt popped out, right? So go ahead and do a poster you tilt all the way for me. So they actually, go ahead and keep going back and forth. Uh, this is like a little recommendation that, you know, just get uh, pelvic mobility back in, right? So I'm going to ask Manny to take a seat here on this seated row for me. So a lot of times when people row, I'm going to hyper they're here, right? So you got to think, right here is where the psoas is starting, and inside your groin is where it's ending. Okay, so now this is at a 90 degree angle, I'm going to roll back, and a lot of times when people roll back, they arch up, they're trying to arch all the way up and get an excessive pinch back here, and this creates a big old curve here and puts a lot of extra tension through your low back and your psoas. Okay, I'm going to release it, and you put it down. So as you're doing your seated rows, guys, stand up, do some hip thrusts. Uh, one common thing that people do it for a back bend, they try and do this, but now your rib cage is trying to bend over your hands, okay, to get some pressure, some hip extension to alleviate some of that tension. Put your hands on your butt cheeks, pinch your butt, and then bend backwards from your low back. Give that a try, guys. Hopefully it'll help your back row, or uh, yeah, your back rows. Thank you.